Hi everybody, this is Stephen Lightfoot for Peter Coppola Beauty. I'm the Technical Director of Product Development and Education and we're here to talk to you about the new Full Volume Styling Cream. This is a standalone product in our line that I'm really excited to show you today. Uh, today with our lovely model Leah, we're going to be doing a basic roller set to give you the idea of the versatility of this product. It has multiple applications. You can use this in a full blowout where you apply from roots to ends, blow it all the way through, it's going to be soft, it's going to give you volume, or you can do it like I'm going to do it today which is add it to the hair after it's been shampooed. I'm going to set it, I'm going to put her under a dryer, I'm going to forget it, and she's going to look marvelous. All right, so we're going to be prepping our model Leah for our roller set. So we're going to get her damp, and we're actually going to shampoo with our sulfate-free and sodium chloride-free total repair shampoo and conditioner. Now remember, when you're doing a roller set, you do want to have as much volume as possible, so do not condition the roots. You want to only condition the ends. So we're going to be conditioning now. Uh, it really, again, it's important that you only condition the ends. Not only is the full volume styling cream going to keep that root lifted and give us that volume that we're looking for, but also it has a high shine and a great conditioner load. So expect the hair to be completely soft and conditioned when you're finished. All right, now that Leah's hair has been shampooed and conditioned, we're going to go ahead and comb it or brush it back straight from the face and get it set up for our roller set. And when it's wet, you can really start to see the fineness and why we're going to be utilizing the full volume styling cream. It makes perfect sense. All right, so now that we have Leah's hair towel dried, as towel dried as I possibly can get it, we're ready to apply product. So our full volume styling cream is a cream, remember. So you're gonna wanna put it into the hand. You're gonna wanna emulsify it. And then you're gonna wanna start at your root. Work it into the hair with the fingers. Make sure you pay extra concentration to the crown area so you make sure you have that product there to give the lift. Work it into the nape of the hair and lightly pull it through. If you have excess product on your hands too much, you'll know if the product is absorbed or not. If you have too much on the hands, wipe it off on a towel. For this particular type of set, I am gonna comb the product through. So I'm gonna move over to a fine tooth tail comb, start at the hairline, move it back, so this should be a really quick service. This is something that you're gonna be able to do in between clients, something that you're able to put her under the dryer and go off and do something else, and she's gonna look fabulous. So now we're gonna to start to part. Now our part is gonna be the center of the eye, to the center of the eye, moving back, apex of the head, forward, pull it up and off, clip this into place, and then the width of your roller, which is approximately two inches, down to directly behind the ear, and here's a great pro tip. If you don't have to, don't twist the hair up. Leave it. You want to do as little to the hair as possible. We want the rollers to accomplish that for us. So same thing here. And we're going to move to the back. All right, so in the back, our section is going to look like this. We're going to part from the apex of the head, straight down to the nape of the neck and we're gonna decide which side we wanna start with our rollers. So, because I'm on the left side, I'm gonna start on the left side. So I'm gonna move this hair out of the way, pin it for later, and then I'm gonna take my first section at the nape of the neck and the width of my roller and pin this out of the way. So here's our first roller and we're gonna comb the hair up to about 135 degrees. We want to do that because we want the maximum volume out of our hair. We're gonna grab our Velcro roller, place it into the hair. Great thing about a Velcro roller is it separates the hair as you move it, so it gets a nice tight hold. Use your comb to add any hair that falls out. And also, typically with a roller, you need a two-prong clip. With a Velcro, you just press it in, and it stays. So let's go ahead and do the rest of the head. And a little bit of fallout's fine. The tighter area is going to give you a tighter curl. The outside's still gonna give you a nice little wave, but it'll incorporate well. This is something that we wanna be able to be fast and convenient for you in the salon. And because I want a little bit more body up at the top, I am gonna switch to a smaller roller. Have a few different types on hand. You can make an educated decision as a stylist as to which ones you're gonna use with each individual section. All right, so the roller set's done, so I just want to go over what we just did. Uh, our client was taken to the bowl, we shampooed, we conditioned just her ends, we applied full volume styling cream, we did our roller set, and the only product we used was full volume styling cream, but I am going to use a medium hold hairspray that we call Steel. Stuff's awesome. 
All right, everybody, we're coming to the end of our Peter Coppola's full volume styling cream basic rollout. Uh, so now at this point, you're gonna take the rollers out. Starting at the bottom and in the back. Sweet, so this is the way that it looks like when you have the rollers out. And as you can tell, we have plenty of volume. Um, it's, the product has definitely done its job, and now we're gonna go ahead and brush it out. If you've done a roller set properly and it's set well, you should be able to brush it out. So what we're looking for is a really voluminous wave, and the easiest way to go ahead and do that is, as the roller is dictated, we're moving off the left-hand side of the face, and we're gonna spin her around, have her tilt her head slightly back, and we're gonna use a bore brush. So you want something with a natural bristle on it, so when you move it through the hair, it smooths and shines at the same time, and it looks like this. So starting at the hairline, I'm gonna move it back away from the face. And again, we're trying to show the merit of the full volume, so we're gonna let the product really dictate the style. Not gonna to do too much work with it. Thanks, Leah, and thanks for watching. Everyone subscribe out there, all right? See you soon.